Yeah, so that was exactly the day I remember, October 5th, 2015. And it was, uh, I had left work because I was just like, oh man, what's, what can we do that's different? Yeah, so I was here in the pond at the farm with these dogs. The major things that I wanted in the truck just kind of came together in my head. And then, of course, it became a whole other animal and a whole amazing thing with the team working on it. But like yeah. those first, like, what if it had a pass-through door and it was great in snow and, you know, all-wheel drive, you know, all the kind of stuff was just like, boom. Yeah, this is the exact truck, actually, that three or four winters ago now, it's like time flies. Uh, so this is one that got stuck and we're like, damn it, why can't they make a good truck? So, you know, that was then held in the back of our minds. The bad four-wheel drive, it's hard to turn in. <laughs> bad, all the weight up front, especially with the plow. So you're like, 90% of your weight is like in front of your feet. What are you doing down there? <laughs> <laughs> Staring at a black screen. <laughs> Everything's been in computers and it's been uh, you know, purchase orders and engineering every part and getting them out. So now it's about getting gearboxes in, motors in, uh, suspension on the whole works. Extension over here.
Uh, it's probably gonna roll today around 4 a.m. 5 a.m. 4 a.m. <laughs> yeah, so we got uh, more LV wiring to do, and then we have to hook up all the HV, and then um, uh, yeah, okay, and then roll it. I see a lot of I went straight to him when I saw it. I was It's just right on the damn diagram. If the channel A, channel B is fine. Oh, yeah, that'd be a It's really. Seats are a bit touchy. That sort of stuff, fine. I think a nice first aid kit would be fine. But yeah, we don't
get the suspension all on. Um, starting to put some of the body pieces on. We get the hood, the bumpers, the doors, or the, the front gate, tailgate, all that stuff needs to go on. Interior still needs to go in yet, but we're we're in the home stretch. This is our last day. This is our last day of building the truck. Uh, well, we already built the truck once or many times, put it together, um, dry build, took it apart, had it all painted, had many, many, many parts painted, and plated and brought all back, and, um, and then little last little fixes and trims, just a touch, but um, so now putting everything back together, making sure we don't scuff any paint. So we have quite a bit of work to do, but getting the batteries in is huge because now everything we can put the floors in the seats in it and build up from there. Four days ago it was parts. <laughs> I got it. Just take the tape off. You missed a spot, Phil.